I decided today to wash up, wash this floor out. I'm going to put plugs in those holes. I'm going to go ahead and get that done. And, uh, still having that problem with the, uh, power drain from the battery. I don't know what's causing that. Um... I got a charger on it right now. I didn't run the battery completely down or nothing, but uh, whatever it is, I still think it's probably the alternator. Several people have told me that think that's what it is. We'll see. Just got to get in there and get that took care of, get that changed out. I think this is going to make a pretty good camper van. It's got a few little bugs need worked out. Like that power drain problem. But other than that, I think it's going to be okay. Yeah, I washed it out a while ago. Washed that off and... I haven't decided yet, but maybe I might uh, put in a, a plywood and put down a linoleum floor. That way it would be easy to sweep out, mop out. I'm not going to go with carpet. I don't like carpet in a vehicle anyhow. So what, what I think I'll do is... Uh, I gotta get with my friend and uh, we'll uh, probably start here, go back with it, border that, and then I will tr might try to find a, like a, a rubber mat that'll fit in the front end. I might do that. I'll look around online and see if I can buy one. Or just put some kind of a real short pile carpet in the front. I do kind of like carpet in the front end of something, but I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I know uh, I did say that I might just go ahead and do my build in it and just put rugs down. May do that. Don't know yet. We shall see. Sitting here parked in the hot sun today is dry, dried all that out. So that's no problem. But got to get these holes plugged up, nevertheless. These, I don't want mice getting in here. You know, there's, they can get through those. I don't want them. mice taking up residence and up there somewhere. So. That's what happened today with it. Just washed it out. Got as much of that residue up that I could and dirt. So, and that, those, that, uh, I don't know if you can see this or not, but I'll try to. There's like insulation that was in here before on the walls like right in there it washed right off when I was spraying the lower part and getting the water you know sprayed out and rinsing I mean 
that stuff just came right off. I mean, I really didn't want to spray high up on the walls, though, because I just, I don't know, I just didn't really want to do that. I, I, may, I might, but I mean, that that stuff, you know, is just is gooey, you know, and it gets wet. But since I know that, you know, I, I know now that it'll, it'll just wipe right off, I'm just going to take probably old terry cloth towels or something and just start wiping it. I'll just wipe that stuff off. So, that's probably what I'll do now. Uh-oh. What is that? Get out of here. And, uh, let's see right there, some of it. If you can see that. Right there. Eh, it won't be too bad to come off now. I thought it would be like, I'd have to take like, duct tape, pull it off, a roll, stick it on there, pull it off, go through a roll of duct tape, you know, but no, it wipes right off. It, it sprayed right off. I, I thought, well, so. Yeah, so far so good. Got, uh, since this is a short wheelbase van, from the back of the seats to the back door is eight feet. So I got eight feet of space in here, about five foot four, uh, five foot five maybe. I think it's five foot five, something like that, up there. So if anybody was like, anybody five foot five or less, they can stand up in this. No problem. I mean, you can stand up. I can't. I'm I'm five foot nine. I have to duck my head just a little bit, but still, yet you know, it'll work. So eight foot from the seats to there, and then you got oh, basically you've got six by ten space in here counting up there. Once I get a seat swivel to put on that passenger seat, I can turn that around. That'll increase the you can sit in that, you know, that'll make it seem like a lot bigger inside. So I guess that's about it for today. Uh, later on.